All right, let's jump into configuring Goverlay. Here's Goverlay. The UI components are a bit scrunched up, and the way it renders out of the box on differing distros and desktop environments can yield differing quirks. It's pretty good software for tinkerers, but right now let's try and look past the quirks and see what the software provides. So you've been looking at the Mango HUD functionality, or at least the first tab. Here's a glance at the VK Basalt view. And the Replay Sorcery view. Let's take a deeper look at the Mango HUD view. The Visual tab allows you to configure the visuals of the on-screen display or heads-up display provided by Mango HUD. Here you can configure the orientation of the heads-up display, font size, font type, and color, or just an overall theme, positioning of the display, transparency, background color, and if you want, rounded corners. The Performance tab provides options regarding which GPU to use, if you have multiple GPUs, a frames per second limit, or FPS limit, and whether you want the data you see on screen in the HUD to be logged to files. Metrics is where the stat indicator picking fun begins. You have a range of stats to add to the display here. GPU load, temperature, power if it's throttling, VRAM usage, driver version, CPU load, load by core, temperature, power, you should click that red button to make it green if you want to see the power stats, etc. There's also graphs. I won't add any of those, but you're free to. The Extras tab is all the other stuff that may not fit into the GPU and CPU sections, stuff like FPS and frame time. Also, a load of other things like what distro you're using, battery percentage if you're on a laptop or a Steam Deck, I guess, what version of wine you're using, you'll be surprised when you realize that matters, and uh, time. So yeah, Global enabled to have these settings get injected in all of your Steam games and save these settings after you set them, and then you'll have to restart the system for these settings to take effect. I'll do the restart now and see you in the next section.